الحمدللہ رب العالمین و صلاۃ وسلام علی نبینا محمد و علی آلہ و اصحابہ و ازواجی اجمعین اما بعد فاعوذ بالله من الشیطان الرجیم بسم الله الرحمن الرحیم رب اشرح لي صدری و یسر لي امری واحلل عقدتا من لسانی یفقهوا قولی ربی زدنی علما اجمعین ان شاء الله می الله سبحانه وتعالى انکریز ان اول اف اس نالج السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ نائس ٹو سی یو بردر اینڈ سسٹرس جسٹ ٹو ریمائنڈ یو بردر اینڈ سسٹرس فار دا اسٹڈی آف بک تھری دا ہیلپ آف حل و تمارین از ایکسٹریملی امپارٹنٹ سو آلویز ریفر سم ٹائمس اف یو آر کنفیوز اینڈ اف یو کین ناٹ فائنڈ دا آنسرس refer to hallo tamarin of book 3 you will notice this from this lesson that how helpful hallo tamarin becomes you know in order to understand it correctly the concept and in order to write correctly the answers you know yesterday we went through the damair brothers and sisters the new thing that we are learning here is uh, Damirun Nasbi Al-Munfasil, uh, which is Iyahu, Iyahuma, okay. And then we were trying to understand that there are certain conditions. Uh, if those conditions are present, then that Damir has to be used, no other Damir. Uh, and so what are those conditions? We remember that if it is from the same category of or same class uh, if the two 
pronouns are coming as a mafulun bihi from the same category, which is how many categories are there? Three. What is it? Damir Ghaib, Huwa Humahum, Damir Mukhatab, Anta Antum Antum, and then Damir Matakalim. So these are three categories. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So if the Damir, two of them come together from the same category, then one will be the normal, uh, and the second will be Munfasil. In other words, the one will be Muttasil, the one Damir will be Muttasil, and the second Damir will be Munfasil. Huh? Are you with me? You have to understand this. Huh? Then, if a Damir Muttasil comes, followed by Harfu Atfin, then the next Damir, which is Mautufun ala, what is before that, has to be Munfasil. After Harfu Harfu Atfin. After Harfu Atfin. Eh? Inshallah, we'll practice. Eh? Everything is mentioned in the key. Eh? Do not get confused with key for book three and Hallo Tamari. Eh? Two separate things. Then the third thing we studied that it will come after Illa. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Eh? La Nabudu. Illa Yahu. Okay. Then the fourth thing we studied that normally the mafulun bihi comes after the fiel. But if the mafulun bihi precedes the fiel, if the mafulun bihi precedes the fiel, comes before it, then it has to be then it has to be munfasil. Iyaka huh? Nabudu. We can say Nabuduka. Now we want to bring that ka, which is muttasil, into front. There is no way ka can come. But when we join ka with iya, then it can come in the front. Iya ka nabudu. Huh? And then there was one more thing, <coughs> which I said, it's a hard check piece. And uh, I didn't do it yesterday, but today inshallah. We will try to understand that. And that is, you know, when there is a master. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? When there is a master and there is a maf'ulun bihi for the master. Now this is absolutely, uh, totally a new concept. We are used to having maf'ulun bihi coming after verb. Now, in our advanced studies, we will come to learn that there can be a mafulun bihi for the master. It's all in the Quran. And then, I also said, since we are doing that, I will give you a little hint of a mafulun bihi coming for ismu file. Huh? And mafulun bihi can come for ismu maful. These are totally new things for us. But all these examples are present in the Quran. So inshallah, when uh, we study and we refer to Quran, things will become more clear. Mind you, <clears throat> still the most frequent mafulun bihi will be after the verb. But sometimes it can come Mafulun bihi can come for master. And mafulun bihi can come for ism file. And mafulun bihi can come for ism mafool. Huh? I want you to go to page number. We start after the exercise, you know. We go to section 2. 232. Page number 232. That is in the new book. But since I have a very old book with me, my pages are different. You know. Are you with me? Number two. Ad-Damiru imma muttasilun wa imma munfasilun. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Huh? Page number 
232 section 2 فالدمير المنفصل ما يبدأه به في النطق what is نطق بدا speech talk what you start with your speech that damir will be munfasil example brother and sisters huwa huma hum ha ana muslimun okay then there is another condition wa yaqau bada illa what is the meaning of yaqau what is the verb Waka, huh? al misal al wawi. Huh? What is the meaning of waka? It has got many meanings to fall, to fall down, or also to occur, to happen. Huh? It occurs bada illa. Okay. Ma fahimat darsa illa anta. Now anta is. Munfasil, but it came after illa. Either it will come in the beginning or it will come after illa. That was, brothers and sisters, Damir Rafa. Now, if it is Damir Nasab, then it is like Iyaka Raitu. So Iyaka is independent, comes in the beginning. Again, Ma raitu illa iyaka. So again the damir came, munfasil came after illa. Are you with me brothers and sisters? Number three, brothers and sisters, iyaka raitu. Why it is iyaka used and not ka? Because it came before the verb. Huh? Huh? You can remember that. Huh? Fine. And after illa, iyaka came. Huh? So, iyaka is still mafulun bi fa raitu. But if you use illa, then you cannot use ka alone. It has to be iyaka. These are very simple rules, brothers and sisters. Very, very simple rules. In fact, you will enjoy studying this lesson very much. And it will give us a lot of information which will help us to understand Quran even better, inshallah. Wa dameerul muttasil ma la. Ma la. Ma his allazi. لا يبدأ به في النطق it does not come in the beginning ولا يكو بعد إلا it cannot come after إلا the damir muttasil cannot come in the beginning it cannot come after إلا كتاي والهاي في رأيته see to has come afterwards and who has come afterwards are you with me brothers and sisters what is to here a file, but damir, it's damir. Is it marfu? Yes, huh? but it came afterwards. It has to be joined. It has to be connected. And what is who? Mafulun bi. But it has to be connected. Huh? Fine. Now, next one, brother. We all know it. Damir Rafi al Munfasila. This we studied in book one with a little song. Huwa humahum. Huwa humahum. Hiya humahunna. Huwa humahum. Hiya humahunna. Anta yantum ma yantum. Anta yantum ma yantum. Anti antum ma antum na. Anti antum ma antum na. Ana nahnu. 
انا نحن هو هما هم هي هما هنا هو هما هم هي هما هنا fine brothers and sisters now comes very important thing please pay attention you already know it it's a excellent revision for us we are still talking about now tamair rafi al muttasila connected huh? attached huh? here are the details brother look at it carefully tau faili al mutaharrik ha huh? mutaharrik ha huh? it means it will have a vowel sign on it ha tau faili al mutaharrikat now kama fi zahabtu zahabti and zahabta so these ta ti tu these are all mutasil and at the same times they are marfu hmm? fine now it is zahab tuma in the beginning of the course you know we used to say take tuma as a file for the sake of simplicity are you with me but today we must decide huh? and understand what is tuma tu is the file there is the file tu and what is this ma doing here ma is alamatu tasniya what is it alamatu tasniya it tells us that it is dual got the idea so if if i say zahab tu where is the file tu if i say zahab tuma where is the file tu not the tuma what is ma then it is a sign of musanna what is it ha huh? what will you say alamatu tasniyati maybe i should write it huh? got the idea brother what is that that is ma in tuma ha huh? got the idea brother and sisters okay now we come to next one brother and sisters zahab tum where is the file tu and this is what is mean alamatu jama ha huh? will you be able to write it alamatu jama very good huh? and zahab tunna where is the file tu huh? highlight it brothers and sisters highlight it only tu huh? and then what is this noon doing here it is alamatu jama but muannas alamatu jamai al muannasi got the idea now this is in detail we are learning huh? okay very good brother alif ul isnaini kama fi zahaba zahaba is madi brother so where is the file alif but this is damir what is it damir ha huh, brother and sisters okay and it is marfu ha huh? so what will you say adamir rafai muttasil but now we are really going deeper huh? and then zahabta again the alif is your file it is your damir and it is damir rafi al muttasil yazhabani same thing where is the file alif which is we call it alif musanna okay and that is your file but what is it damir rafi al muttasil tazabani got the idea and then izhaba what is izhaba amar 
Shelo Amrin. So what is this Alif? That is your file. File. Huh? That is your file. So, brother and sister, it is your Damir Rafi Al Muttasil. Got the idea? Very good. Waul Jamati. Kamafi Zahabu. Yazabuna and Idhabu. Tazhabuna is not mentioned, but we know it. But what is Idhabu? Amar. Are you? So where is the file? Wow. wow. And what is that wow? It's a Damir. Huh? Damir Muttasil. It's Damir Rafi. Yaw Muhatabi. Okay. Tazabina. See? So that is the same thing. It is your file. It is your Damir Rafi Al Muttasil. Is habi, what is is habi? Amar. Again the file is Damir Muttasil, but it is Marfu. You know, I'm sure every one of us understands, because we have been doing this for the past few months, so you should be very strong. Nunu Niswati, Kamafi, Zahabna. Yazhabna, Izhabna. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Very good. So these are all Damiru Raf Al Muttasil. Na Kamafi Zahabna. So that Na is your file, it is a Damir, it's a Muttasil, and it is Marfu. Fine. Damairu Naspi Al Munfasila. Brother? We did yesterday, okay? Yahu, Yahuma. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? You got to memorize it now. It's very easy. If you follow the song and hum it, inshallah, you will have no problem. I'll do one more time, brothers and sisters. Yahu, Yahuma, Yahum. Yaha, Yahuma, Yahuna. Iyaka, Iyakuma, Iyakum. Iyaki, Iyakuma, Iyakunna. Iyaya, Iyana. Alhamdulillah. Okay. No, brothers and sisters, Damayrun Nasbi, Al Muttasila. Very beautiful example Dr. Sahib has given. Sa'alahu, Sa'alahuma. So you are using the verb, he asked. He asked her, he asked two of them, he asked them, he asked you. Are you with me? And finally, Sa'alani, he asked me. And then Sa'alana, he asked us. Huh? So it's very simple, huh? inshallah. Then Dr. Sahib is mentioning Damirun Nasbil Muttasil Lil Mutakallim Ya Fakat Amma Nunu Fayuta Bihi Li Vikayati It is brought for protection. Ma Kablaha Min Kasri Okay? It is uh, brought down to protect the word from getting it a Kasra. The noon gets the kasra. Okay, but then she said, what to samma? And it is called noon vikaya. Got the idea, but then sisters? The mayar jar. La tati illa muttasilan. It does not come except as attached. Muttasil. That's it. And you know. Rabbuhu, Rabbuhuma, Kitabuhu, Kitabuhuma, Dinuhu, Dinuhuma, Baituhu, Baituhuma, like that, brothers and sisters. And also, Minhu, Minhuma, Lahu, Lahuma, Laka, Lakuma, Laki, Li, Lana, all these are, uh, these are Damair, Jar, Al Muttasila. Fine, brothers and sisters. 
Now comes number three. Now this is where we have to pay a little more attention, brothers and sisters. Yota bi damirun nasp munfasila. Munfasila. Okay. When is it brought? Huh? When do you bring that? Iza kana mafulan bihi. It will come. It is brought. Okay. Iza kana. If it is mafulun bihi. Wa takaddama ala fi'alihi. And it precedes the verb. Its verb. Huh? It precedes its verb. Huh? Nahu. Iyaka na'budu. Fine. Is when asluhu na'budu ka. Here is whether something that she will have to pay attention. Is a waka maf'ulan. Li mastarin. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? If it occurs as a maf'ulun bihi, for the master. Mudafin ila fa'ilihi. Are you with me? Mudafin ila fa'ilihi. Now that master, that master is mudaf. And then that fa'il is mudaf ilihi. Now this is a hard chickpea. But inshallah, if we ponder over it and think about it, you will be able to understand it. Nahu Ziyaratul Mudiri Iyana. Brothers and sisters, tell me Ziyaratu Mudiri. Mudafilai. Mudaf, Mudafilai. What is Ziyaratu? Masta. And Al Mudiri is Mudafili. Okay? The Mudir is Mudafili. But actually, it is the file. Huh? And Master is the Mudaf. How do I understand this? Sounds complicated. But inshallah, if we break it down, Okay, then you will understand. Now remember, as you will study Quran constantly, inshallah, consistently, inshallah, and you will be reading more books in Arabic, you will come across these situations. I do not expect that you will be able to do each and every sentence that will come in front of you that way. But slowly and slowly you will be. You will master it, inshallah. Let us see the example uh, and then we break it down. Okay? Fine, brothers and sisters. I'm going to write down. Huh? First, brothers and sisters, you have to understand that Damir Nas Munfasil is Mafulun Bihi for Master. Now, and the Master is the Mudaf, and then the file of the verb is Mudafilihi. I don't see as a file here. But if I say like this, hmm. now what alamat shall I give? Yazuruna al mudi. Ru has to be ru. Huh? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? 
Yazuruna al-mudiru. Is it mudiru file? Now change Yazuru into master. What is the master of Zara Yazuru? Ziyarat. So it became Ziyaratul Mudiri. Huh? Are you with me? This became Ziyaratu Al Mudiri. Huh? And then Na came out as a Munfasil. Iyana. Huh? Again, I repeat, brothers and sisters, Ziyaratul Mudiri, Mudiri is Mudafilihi. And the Mastar is Muda. Okay. But actually, the Mudafilihi is the file. If you change the Mastar back, so I repeat again, brothers and sisters, Ziyaratul Mudiri, the Mastar is Mudaf and Mudaf Ilehi is Mudir, but that Mudir is actually the file of the verb. Which verb? If you take the master and change into verb, then, then Mudir is the file. Huh? Example huh? Yazuru Na Al Mudiru. You can also say if you want to Yazuru Al Mudiru Iyana. If you want to, but the better will be Yazuruna Al Mudiru. So, what is Al Mudir? File. Huh? File. Huh? But when you change Yazuru into Ziyara, then it became Ziyaratul Mudiri, Iyana. The visit of the Mudir to us. Got the idea? That is what is the meaning of this sentence, brother. There is another sentence coming. Then what is that, brother? Darbuka. Iaya ashaddu min darbi iaka. Brothers and sisters, this is another tough thing. But as I said to you, you may not be able to change the master into verb quickly. But don't worry, understanding is extremely important. So what is it now, brothers and sisters? Darbuka Iyaya. Are you with me? Darbuka Iyaya. Now I'm changing. What is it? Daraptani. You hit me. So darbuka iaya means you're hitting me. Daraptani, you hit me. Huh? And then what will you say? Ashaddu was more severe. Huh? Then you will say min. Huh? And then you will say min. And again, you will here put ma, which will be mim ma. Now, this ma is mastariya, brother and sisters. But I am not going in detail. Min ma. Got the idea? Write it down, brother and sisters. Daraptani When you will say Daraptani then you will change Ashaddu into Ashadda Got the idea brothers and sisters? Mimma Daraptuka I'm only pointing your attention to this now. Darbuka. 
What is darbu kya brothers and sisters? Mudaf, mudaf, mudaf. Sahi? Now, no. if I tell you ka is the fahil, you will say ka is the fahil? Huh? How? We change that. Darbuka iyaya, we change that to daraptani. So that ka change into ta. Huh? Are you with me? Okay, fine. Please try to read it a few times. Inshallah, you will understand. Okay. Since we have to understand some concepts, will take a little longer to sink in our mind, but eventually it will sink. When you see more examples like this, brother, what will you say? I know it. It is the master uh, and it has mafulun bihi. You will say, there is a mafulun bihi for master. Uh, okay. I'm now sidetracking you, brothers and sisters. Uh, I'm sidetracking you now. I said to you, there can be a mafulun bihi for master. There can be mafulun bihi for ism file. There can be mafulun bihi for ism maful. Now I have a beautiful example of ism file uh, having a mafulun bihi. Very beautiful example. I would request you to memorize this verse. I found this to be the easiest verse to memorize, even though it is long. You know why it is easy? Because you understand what you are saying. Once you understand what you are saying, then the, you can memorize the Quran with ease. So here is another advantage of our studying the Arabic language, that when you will try to memorize, the memorization of the Quran will become very easy for you. Hmm? Extremely easy for you, uh, the memorization of the Quran. Why? Because you understand what you are memorizing. Eh? And makes it interesting, not boring. Brothers and sisters, this is the one uh, verse in the Quran in which ten, ten ism files are used. Both Muzakkar and Manas. So this is a very unique verse. Eh? Okay, It starts with Inna. I think most of you may know it. Huh? Inna. Okay. So, Inna al Muslimina. What did he say? What did I say? Inna al Muslimina. Wal Muslimati. But then, brother, you continue. Wal Mominina, Wal Mominati, Wal Kanitina. Walkani tati, wasadi kina, wasadi kati, wasabirina, wasabirati, walkashiina, walkashiati, walmutasadi kina, walmutasadi kati, wasaimina, wasaimati, and then walhafidina, furuja, oh, brother, what is this? Huh? Okay. Wal hafi zina furujahum. But then what is this furuja? Mafu but I don't see the verb. This is mafulun bihi far isam file. Mafulun bihi far Ism file. Are you with me? The next was uh, Allah. Again, the same thing. Wa Zakirina Allah. Ha! Why Allah? I don't see any verb there. So this is Mafulun Bihi. List me file. What is it? For the ism file. This is a beautiful, beautiful verse, brothers and sisters. Try to study at home and try to memorize it. 
Are you with me? Try, it's very easy to memorize, brother. Listen. You know, sometimes we find difficult to memorize Quran. I find that no longer it is difficult. Once I understand, it makes very easy and it's fun to memorize. Because then you can say those verses in your salah. Huh? You can say it all the time, brothers and sisters. Huh? Instead of saying just few short surahs in your salah, repeating it thousands and thousands of times, we change it. We say different verses in our salah. So brother, can you see? No, you can easily understand that. Huh? These are all ism file. How they are made, you can easily say which verb uh, they are representing. Hmm? And at the same time, we have to make it jama. Al-Muslimu will become Al-Muslimuna. Huh? Make it monas. Al-Muslimatu. Now bring it in. So you will say, Innal Muslimina. Jama Muzakar Salam. Now it is Mansu. And then, Wal Muslima Ti. Why Ti? Mansu. Why do you give a Kasra? Jama See, now you know all these rules and regulations. So then, brother, if you think the sequence in your mind, it's all memorized. Huh? Are you with me, brother and sister? Let's do it one more time. All of us, look at this and try to say it. Inna al-Muslimina wal-Muslimati wal-Mu'minina wal-Mu'minati wal-Kanitina wal-Kanitati wal-Sadiqina wal-Sadiqati wal-Sabirina wal-Sabirati wal-Khashi'ina wal-Khashi'ati wal-Mutasaddiqina وَالْمُتَصَدِّكَاتِ وَالسَّائِمِينَ وَالسَّائِمَاتِ وَالْحَافِذِينَ فُرُوجَهُمْ Immediately this strikes. Hey, hey, what is this furuja? How, why it is mansu? The answer is, it's mafulun bihi. So where is the verb? No, it is not the verb. It is the ism file which made it mafulun bihi. Got a mafulun bihi. So, وَحَافِذِينَ فُرُوجَهُمْ And then, وَالْحَافِ ذَاتِ وَزَاكِرِينَ اللَّهَ كَثِيرًا مَفُولٌ مُطْلَقْ What is the actual? وَزَاكِرِينَ اللَّهَ ذِكْرًا كَثِيرًا See, see the beauty, brother. Can you translate this? No. You got to understand it directly. وَزَاكِرَاتِ huh? Okay, brother. Now I ask you one question. Inna. What is inna? Harfu tawkid and nasbin. Where is ismu inna? Musli mean. Huh? Is it mansu? Yes. Alamatu nasbihi al yaw. Li annahu jama zakar sale. Well, muslimati. What is muslimati? Also mansu, but mautufun ala muslimina. And then if you say, well, mominina. That is Mautufunala, Muslim Meena. So everything is Mautufunala, Muslim Meena. Got the idea? Brothers and sisters, where is the Khabarina? Huh? Now comes the Khabarina. See, Khabarina came after half a kilometer. It is away from the Ismu Inna. Huh? So the Khabar is, brothers and sisters, Adallahu lakum, lahum, lahum. What is Allah prepared for them? Magfiratan wa ajran adiman. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Adda. What kind of a verb is this? Form 4. What is the meaning of it? To prepare. Huh? Okay? For everybody who's mentioned. See, this is a unique verse because in this work, both Muzakkar and Monas are mentioned side by side. Huh? Huh? And then Allah says, truly the one 
who's Muslim and Muslima and Mu'min and Mu'mina, for them, for them Allah has prepared. What has Allah prepared? Adallahu lahum for them. What has Allah prepared for them? Maghfirah. And more than that, Ajran. So what is Ajran? Mautufun ala Maghfira. Wow, okay. Got the idea? Ajran Azim. Okay. So see, now you are understanding directly, brother. Now when you will read this, and inshallah you will memorize it, because this is very easy to memorize. Each and every word you understand. Adda you understand. Okay. Ajran, you understand. Aziman, not, you understand. So, the point, you know, is to understand that there is a mafulun bihi, and it is because of ism file. Got the idea? Similarly, there will be a mafulun bihi for ism maful. Inshallah, I'll bring the example to you. And then there is a mafulun bihi for master. Got the idea? No, we will be watching huh, in our future studies. It will come and you will notice it. Huh? Because it is the habit of Dr. Saab that once he brings in a concept, then he repeats it. You know, further down the lesson, it will come to us, inshallah. Got the idea, one sister? So watch for mafulun bihi for master. Now, it is easy to identify it because it will be Damir Nas Munfasila. Huh? It will be Munfasila. Which means it will be in the form of Iyahu, Iyana, Iyaya, like that. So it will be easy. Number third, brothers and sisters, what is the Ida Baka Bada Harfi Atfi? If it occurs after conjunction, Raituka, huh? see Raituka, so Ka is your Bafulun Bihi, and then Harfu Atfin came, Va, then Padar Iyahu. You cannot say Raituka Vahu, no, it has to be now Munfasil. Inni Va Iyaka. So what is Iyaka here? Mautufun ala? Ya. Got the idea? So if Ya is Mansub, then we have to have a Damir, which is Mansub, which is Iyaka. Najihani. Number fourth, brothers and sisters, Iza waka bada illa. Nahu. For example, Ma saltu illa Iyaka. I did not ask anyone except you. Huh? La nabudu illa iyahu. Huh? Okay, brothers and sisters. Number five is a waka'a ba the damir nasab muttasil. Now, aina majallatul mudiri. What is the answer? Ataituhu iyaha. Okay, now there's an explanation for this. Ida kana damirani min rutbatin wahidatin. What is the rutbatun? Class, category. Are you with me? If it is from the same class or category, then, brothers and sisters, wajaba, then it is necessary al faslu. What is the meaning of al faslu? Detachment. Then it has to be detached. Kama fil misal is sabik. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? It has to be detached. Kama fil misal is sabik. From the previous example. Wa iza ikhtalafa fi rutubati. If they are from different class, you know. Jaz al waslu. Well, faslu. What is the meaning of jaza? To be permissible. Huh? It is permissible, detached, or attached. 
Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Vaslu means, brothers and sisters, attached. And Faslu means detached. Means attachment and detachment both are permissible. Now, Aina Kitabi, translation, brother. Where is my book? Ataituka Hu. I gave it to you. Or you can say, Ataituka Iyahu. Both are permissible. But if it is from the same class, same category of pronouns, then it has to be, then it has to be, brothers and sisters, detached. Which is in the first example. What is it? Ataituhu Iyaha. Okay, change that Iyaha. Remove Iya and make it only Ha. How will you say? Ataituhu Ha. From the same class. Huh? It has to be separated. Has to be, one is mutasil and other has to be munfasil. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Very good. Adamahiru salafu rotabin. Are you with me? The dhamis are, the pronouns are in three categories. Three class. Huh? Adamahiru salafu rotabin. Wahiya Rutbatul Ghaibi. Are you with me, Mrs. Do you understand Rutbatul Ghaib? The category of the pronoun which is which are absent. And its pronouns are Dhamairuha, Huwa Humahum. Now you know that, brothers and sisters. Rutbatul Mukhatabi. Rutbatul Mukhatabi. Rutbatul Mukhatabi. Wa dama'iruha anta antuma. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Rutbatul Mutakallim. Wa dama'iruha. How many are there? Ana ana. So you, we know all these things. Now we are trying to understand it in a little bit more detail, eh, brothers and sisters. Fine, brothers and sisters. That's it. Now we go to the main lesson. Huh? We go to the main lesson and inshallah you will try to analyze it. Each and every dhami that will come. Please open your Hallo uh, Tamari. And I want to explain to you brothers and sisters. Try to analyze each and every pronoun. Dhamir. Is it marfu? If it is marfu, then is it monfasil? Or is it Motasil. If it is uh, Damir, is it Mansu? Then the question is, is it Monfasil, Motasil? And then the number third, if the Damir is Majrur, then there is only one class, Motasil. There is no Monfasil. So it's easy. Now, <clears throat> in the Ahalo Tamari, there are six columns. And you will have to uh, figure out, brothers and sisters, where does it fit? Uh, now, if the Damir is attached pronoun, then the whole thing has to be written. Because you cannot write Ka on its own. Ka has to be Sa'ala Ka. Uh, or Ataitu Ka. So the whole thing has to be written. Because it is Attached pronoun. Got the idea? Okay. Watch for it. The way Dr. Sahib has explained, you will do it on your own and then you will do it without looking at the key. Huh? Don't look at the key. You just make the column and then do it. I have written the columns here, brothers and sisters. Now, I want you to pay attention to exercise number three. In which... When the Damirun Nas Munfasila comes, you know, you got to give a reason. Are you with me? You got to give a reason. So there is a reason for that. Huh? And I had written it, but I rubbed it off. It is Li Bukuihi. What is the meaning of Li Bukuihi? For occurring it. 
for the occurring of it. Huh? For the occurring of it after Bada Li Wukoihi Bada and then you will give the reason. Or if it is coming before the verb, Li Takadumihi. Remember Takadumi. Got the idea? Takadumi. He. So watch for this and you can get help from the Hallo Tamari. Okay? And it can also come Li Wukuihi Mafulan. Li Wukuihi Mafulan. Li Mastarin Mudafin Ila Failihi. Now this is a long sentence. Brothers and sisters, if you write it a couple of times, inshallah, it will become easy for you. And if you have difficulty in saying this, brothers and sisters, don't worry. Just say it in English. Are you with me? Understanding is extremely important. Later on, you will become more proficient in writing, writing the Arabic expressions, inshallah. Everything, huh? brothers and sisters, Everything you got to figure out. And I'll be asking every one of you. If you cannot answer, doesn't matter. It's okay, brother. Huh? Okay, sometimes you know it, but when you are asked, your mind freezes. You cannot find the answer. So don't worry. Al Mudaris, Yausama. Okay, Al Murakibu, Yatulubuka. Fi maktabihi. Okay, brothers and sisters. Yatlubu. What is Yatlubu? Where is the file? Mustatir. Takdiruhu? Huwa. So it means the dami huwa is Mutasil Mustatir. Are you with me? Brothers and sisters, I have written again those sentences. <coughs> Let me reassure you and let me encourage you, brothers and sisters, that if you do not get 100%, don't worry. Even I did not get it 100% in the first time. It took me a little longer to understand. If you can understand, alhamdulillah, and then later on, when you will revise it, all these things will become part of your Memory. You will not find it difficult, brothers and sisters. You will not find it difficult, inshallah. Huh? Okay, now we start. Yatlubu. Where will you put Yatlubu? Where will you put Yatlubu? Huh? Yeah. Huh? Okay. Fine. And then it says, Yatlubu. Ka. So where will you put that? You cannot put, put ka on its own. It has to be yatlubu ka. Okay. See now you are putting and then makta b. So you will have to say fi mak. Ta, B, He. Huh? So, we are only interested in He, which is Damir, Jar, Mutasil. Huh? But then you have to write the whole thing. Similarly, you write everything. Huh? I will only give you some examples, brothers and sisters. Okay. Ya Osama al Murakibu, Yatlubu Ka, Fi Maktabi He. The Murakib is asking for you to be in his office. Uridu. Where will you put Uridu? Mustatir. Huh? You will put Uridu there. Huh? I'll put Uridu again here. If you will do this exercise, what will be the result? You will just become very, very strong. Huh? Uridu. And Akhuza, where will you put Akhuza? Same place. Huh? Akhuza, you'll put the same place, brother. Akhuza. I'll just do a few, you know. Akhuza. 
Ahuza. Fine. Does it make sense? Huh? Inshallah. Huh? Huh? Ma'i. Where will you put Ma'i? In the last column. Huh? Ma'i. Zamilaya. Where will you put Zamilaya? What is it? Mudah Mudafili. Again the last column. Huh? Okay. Hazaini is not. Lam yatulubil muraqibu illa iyaka. So where will you put iyaka? Mun, munfasil. Huh? Is there anything interesting for us in this? No, nothing interesting. Huh? Aksha. Mustatir. Huh? Annahu, where will you put annahu? Huh? You will put here, annahu here. Huh? Annahu here. And Aksha you will put here. Got the idea, brother and sister? Aksha, Annahu, Nasiya. Where will you put Nasiya? Here. Huh? Nash- Nasiya. Okay, brothers and sisters. Inni. Where will you put Inni? Huh? After Anhu, you'll put Inni. Wa Iyahuma, where you'll put Iyahuma? Munfasil. Huh? Are you with me? Okay. I'll just write down. Iyaka. And then Iyahuma. Huh? Remember, it is one word. Huh? And they said, Inni will come here. Fine. Mustarikuna fi musabakati sibahati. Translation, brothers and sisters. Translation. Huh? He did not ask, the Murakib did not ask except you. He did not, did not ask anyone except you. Okay. I'm afraid that he has forgotten. Truly, I and Yahuma, two of them, we are participants uh, in the swimming competition. Khuzhuma. Brother, how will you write? You will have to write Khuz here. Hmm? Because it is Mustatir. And then you will write... uh, here. But again you will write down both of it. Because you cannot write Homa alone. If you write Homa alone then it is Marfu. It is only Mansu if you write it attach Khuz Homa. Got my point? Inshallah. Aina Kitabul Mudiri Ya Ibrahim Now comes Ataituhu Iyahu. Now, where will you put Ataituhu? Because there is a file there. So you will say, huh? Huh? Uh, Atau Fi Got the idea? Where is the file? Atau fi ataituhu. Is it clear, brother and sister? Where is the file? Atau fi ataituhu. Correct? No. Then who is also wafulun bihi? So you'll put in the column of Damir Nasab Mutasil. The whole thing you'll put it there. Ahataitu who? And then where will you put Yahu? Huh? You will put Damir Nasab Munfasil. Huh? Inshallah. So if you have a lined paper, go line by line and follow it. 
and then inshallah you will find it's very interesting. It may take you, uh, if you have the columns ready, then it won't take you long, maybe half an hour, and you will be able to do this whole exercise. But what will be the result, brothers and sisters? You will become very strong. Now I'm going to ask you individually. Okay, I'm going to ask you individually. Next one. Al Mudaris, wa aina dafati labi. Translation? Uh, where are the notebooks of the students? Okay. Taitu hum iyaha. Badar Muhammad, taitu hum iyaha. Will you be able to figure out? You can't? Don't worry. Huh? Badasan, don't worry. Uh, Sister Hafsa, Ataitu uh, hum ya. Ha. Translation first. I gave them these. I gave it to them these, you know. Fine. So where are you now? Two, you will write down. Atau fi ataitu hum. And then. So where will you write down? In the Damir Nasab. Muttasil. Muttasil. Huh? You will write down that Ataitu hum. Huh? In there. And then, Ya Ha, where will you write down? In the Munfasil column. Got the idea? It's very simple. Wa Aina Majallati. What is the translation, Sister Abhi? Where is my magazine? So what is Majallati? Mashallah Mudaf Mudafir. Where will you put it? In the last column. In the column of Jar. Huh? Very good. Man. Next one, you do the other one also. Ataitu Kaha. Translation, I gave it to you. I gave it to you. Huh? Uh, no, the whole thing will come. Ataitu. You, if you put even Ataitu, that's good enough. Tau fi Ataitu. And then Ka and Ha. They are both coming together. Where will you put them? They are nasa. Where will you put? They are muttasil. So you will write down in the damir nasp, muttasil, the whole thing. Huh? Because you cannot write separately. So you got to write it, the whole thing. Got the idea? Sister Abhi? Mashallah. Sister Sumaya? Mata ataita niha. Mata ataita niha. Translation? Huh? When did you give it to me? When did you give it to me? Huh? The translation is simple, brother. It's easy, inshallah. Huh? Okay, so yeah. Ataita. You can write down only Ataita or you can write down the whole thing. Doesn't matter. Ataita. Ataufi Ataita. Huh? That is your uh, Muttasil. Huh? So, sister, uh, Atau. Fi ataita. And then, then it will go to the nasab muttasil. Got the idea? Damirun nasab. Damirun nasbi. Damirun nasbi al muttasil. Okay, fine. And then noon vikaya, remember? That is a noon vikaya there. Ataitu ka ha. Did we do this? Kaha, we did this. Huh? Ataitu will come here. Huh? Just like Mata Ataita, Mata Ataita, and now we have Ataitu. Fine. Amsi fi Maktabika. Where will that go? In the last column. Huh? Because this is Mudaf uh, Mudafili. Huh? Now, still, the, there is more. Huh? Akhastaha, where will this go? Akhasta. Akhasta will come here. Got the idea? Akhasta, sister Sumaya, because it is ta is your file. A tau fi akhasta. And where will ha go to? Mutasil. So you will write down there akhasta ha. Okay, because ha cannot come by itself. Okay. Wa Vadataha. Where will Vadata go? Again here. And then Vadataha will go there. Fiddurji huh? in the drawer. Huh? Naam. Udar is saying Naam. Alana tazakkartu. 
You got a very simple sentence, Sister Naima. Alana tazak kartu. What is the translation of it? Now I remember. Huh? So what is the verb? Tazak kara. Huh? So tazak kartu, where will it go? In the first column. You write down atau huh? fi tazak kartu. Got the idea? Inshallah. Again, you have some more. Masmuka, where will you go? Ismuka will go in the last column. Huh? Mudaf, mudafili. Huh? Ya akhi, where will akhi go? Last column. Huh? Mudaf, mudafili. So it's very simple. Huh? Remember, ismuka. What is ismuka? Mudaf, mudafili. Iska, majrur. Yes, it is majrur because it is mudafili. So it will go in the last column. Adamirur jar. Adamirul Jarri Al Muttasil. And Akhi, what is Akhi? How many words are there? Two. Mudaf Mudafili. Where will it go? Where will it go, brothers and sisters? It will go in the last column. It is Jar. If you pay a little attention, it's very simple. These are not difficult, brothers and sisters. We have been doing it for a long time. It is just that we are doing in very much detail. Sister Aisha, the teacher asked, Masmukayahi to a brother, and the brother is replying, Aiyaya tas alu ya ustad? Translation. Are you asking me? <laughs> so, what is Iyaya, Sister Aisha? Uh, it is Munfasil. Huh? Nasr. It's uh, uh, Damirun Nasbi Al Munfasil. Fine. Why has it come like that? Li Li Takadumihi Allah Fialihi. What is it? What is the reason? Li Takadumihi Allah Fialihi. Because it preceded the verb. Now you got to take help of the Hello Tamarin in writing the proper sentences, brother. Fine. Sister uh, Nasreen. Naam. Iyaka as'alu. Mansuba. Munfasil. Why has it come in the beginning? The answer is li taqaddumihi ala fialihi. Because it Preceded the fail. Okay, fine. Now, Nusrat, Ismi Okasha. So, what is Ismi? Mudaf. Where will it go? In the last column. Okay. Iltahattu Bil Mahadi Al Yom. Where will it go? Iltahattu, Sister Nusrat? It will come here. You will say, Atau Fi Iltahattu. Got the idea? Waltahaka mai, waltahaka mai. Are you with me? Waltahaka mai. So what is mai? Yeah, it is go, it's a jab. Ja. But brother, same sister, waltahaka has come. Should we put it here? Or should we put it here? No, because the file is there. Where is the file of waltahaka? Sarasatu. The file is there. Okay? The file is there, so there is no damir there. Salasatu tulabin min baladi nusrat. Baladi will come to in the file, Masha. Okay, now you have a very simple answer. Hum fi faslin. Only here, hum will come. Hum will come here. Brothers and sisters, inshallah. Very good. Arju an to say the ni. But the ni has come. So this is Nusrat. It will be Damirun Nasb Mutasil. So you will write there to say the ni. Okay. Also, you will say, uh, where will you write more? Here. Because to say the has Damirun Mustatirun. Huh? Are you with me? Tusaidu has Damir Mustatir. Where will it come? 
in this column. Uh, you will write down here. Okay? Fine. Fakad Fatatani. Fatatani. Where will you put? What is this? Yamata Kalam. Mafunun Bihi. Where will you put? Here. Where will you put? Here. Uh, are you with me? Because it is Mafunun Bihi. Huh? Is there a file for Fatat? Yes, yes, so we don't have to do anything else. Okay. Sister um, Manas. Sa Usai Duka. No, Sa is. Uh, are you talking about Sa? The Sa is a half. Usaid. Where will you put Usaid? No. You won't put. Why? Ka is mafulun bi, so you will put there. In this column. Huh? In this column. But Usaida, where will you put Usaida? Mustatir. So it will come in this column, not in this column. Huh? It will come in this column. This is uh, Damir which are muttasil, okay? And here, they are not mustatir. The mustatir are here. They are visible. Huh? Got the idea? Alhamdulillah. You can do one more. Yahum will come there, of course. Lan nansa. What is nansa? Where will you put nansa? Where is the file in nansa? Mustatir. So you will put in the column of Mustatir. Musadataka. Huh? Where will you put that thing? It will be here in the this column. Musadataka. It will come in this column. Okay? Huh? Iyana. Iyana will come here. Huh? Are you with me? Iyana will come here. Fine. Now, brothers and sisters, let us translate. Otherwise, some of you will have a difficulty in understanding. My name is Ukasha. Iltahattu bil Mahadi al Yom. I joined the institution today. And three students from my country joined. Are you with me? Waltahaka Mai Salasatu Tulabin. Three students joined with me from my country, Min Baladi. Sahi? They are whom? Fi Faslin Akhara. They are in the other class. Hum Mubtada, where is the khabar? Fi Faslin. Okay? Fi Faslin Jar Majur Shibu Jumla Khabar. What is akhara? Naat. Huh? Naat. Okay, it's majroor. It's uh, mamnoom in sarf. So you do not see kasra. Arju an tusaidani. What is the translation? I request you to help me. Fakad fatatni durusun kasirun. I have missed many lessons. Huh? The many lessons have missed me. Okay. What is the mother is saying? Sa usaiduka. I will help you. Wa iyahum. And them. Inshallah. Then Ukasha is saying. Lan nansa. We will not forget your help to us. Are you with me brothers and sisters? Lan nansa. How will you describe nansa? Huh? I'm sure Afsa can do it, but I will do it, uh, inshallah. Fialun, mudariun, mansubun. Wa alamatun nasbihi al fatahatu mukaddara. And where is the file? Mustatir. Takhdiruhu nahnu. That's why we, you will put it here in this column. Okay. Now, brothers and sisters, what is musada? Uh, it is. No, it's master. Huh? Master from form three. Musa'ada tun. Musa'ada tun. 
but it is mansub here. Musa'adata ka. So what is musa'adata? It is your mafulun bihi. For nansa. Are you with me? Wa huwa mudaf. And ka mudaf ilihi. Huh? So, brothers and sisters, if I say to you that uh, musa'adata ka will come in this column, it is incorrect. It has to come in this column. Uh, but we are only talking about Damir. What is Musadata is Mansu. But we are not talking about that. We are talking about only Damir. So it is the Damir Ka. And what is that Ka? Mudah Mudah. So you will write down here uh, Musadata Ka. Uh, because this is your Mudaf. Mudaf ilahi. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Do you get it? Huh? Okay. And then you'll put iana here in this column. Huh? Fine. Is everybody with me now? Okay. Look at it, brothers and sisters. Nansa got the mafulun bihi. Where is that mafulun bihi? Musaadata. That is the mafulun bihi for. Nansa. And this Iyana has come. What is Iyana? Mafulun bihi for, for Master. What is it? Mafulun bihi for Master. Where is the Master? Musadata. Huh? See, you got the idea? Huh? So that is Iyana is li wukuihi mafulun li Masterin. Mudafin ila fa'ilihi. Okay. Now, brothers and sisters, if you wish, I will write down a sentence. You can write it. Huh? What did I write, brothers and sisters? Huh? What did I write? Musa Adata. You change it and it becomes Master Mawa. Lan Nansa. We will not forget. An Saatana. You, you helped us. Huh? Okay. Now here, if you see, Na is Mafulun Bihi for the Sa'ada. Got the idea? And ta is your fa'il. It is your fa'il. Okay. And this change into Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Please write it down. And then ponder over it. I do not expect you that you will become master in two days. But slowly and gradually, brothers and sisters, all these things will become very clear to you. So, look at it. Li wuku'ihi mafa'ulan. Li mastarin mudafin ala fa'ilihi. So what is Iyana? Okay, it's Maful. Maful for what? Li Master. This is your Master. Okay. Mudafin ilafi alihi. Is this? Uh, this is Mudafin, this is Mudafili. So Ka is actually a file. Not now. Now it is Mudafilihi. But actually it is file. When Will it become like that if you change into the master more? Huh? See now that ka, where did it go? It changed into 
Ta, are you with me? Here the ka is mudaf ilayhi, and here the ta is fa'il. So that's why this sentence is written like this, brothers and sisters. If you even understand 50%, it's good enough, brothers and sisters. By writing all these things and pondering over it, brothers and sisters, you will master it, inshallah. Remember, I did not understand in day or two. It took me a week or more of constantly trying to figure out what is happening here. You know, and inshallah you'll get it. Huh? Inshallah. Fine. We move forward. Huh? Sister uh, Arifa, are you ready for the question? Araka. Araka tujidul lugatal arbiyata. What is the meaning of this? I find you or I think you are very proficient in the Arabic language. Huh? Okay. Tujidu is to be proficient. Huh? Ajada yujidu. Okay. So araka. What is ka? Are you with me? Where is ka? Mafulun bi. So where will you put it? Araka. You will put in this column. Are you with me? And also, you will put in this column. Huh? Because there is the file of Ara, Mustatir. You will put it in this column. It's Mustatir. Huh? Sister Arifa? So Araka will come here, Ara will come here, and Araka can come here in this column. Hmm? Fine, brothers and sisters. Now you have the key, it will help you a lot. Hello, huh? Tamari. Araka Tujidu Logatal Arbiata. So brother, is there something in Tujidu? Yes, there is a mustatir. So you will put it here. Huh? Sister Arifa? Tujidu. Where is the file? Anta. Are you with me? The file is Anta. Inshallah. Man Alamaka Yaha. Okay, you know where to put Iyaha. Okay. Allamaka. Huh? It will be in the third column. Yes, mashallah. Will be in this column. And then Iya will become. Mashallah. Translation. Who taught you the, the, the language? Huh? What is the answer? Sister Absa. Allamani Iyaha Abbi. So Abbi is the file for Allamani. Uh, so we don't have to worry about that. But only Allamani is there's a mafulun bihi. So we will put the mafulun bihi in the Muttasil column. Uh, got the idea, brothers and sisters? And where will Iyaha come? In the other column. Uh, with the fourth column. Uh, okay, fine, brother. Fine. Okay, Abi will come in the last column. Mudaf, Mudafil here. Yeah? So you got to find out about the Damir. In, you know, you got to become Sherlock Holmes huh? and watch for it. Okay. Ikra al ayat ya Hamid. Hamid yastaizu wa yubasmilu. Thumma yakrau. Okay, brothers and sisters, yastaizu and mustate. So you will put yastaizu there. And you basmilu, you will put the you basmilu also in which column? In third column. Huh? Third column. And yakrau also in the third column. Iyaka na abudu. Iyaka will be in your fourth column. And na abudu, where will na abudu? In the third column. Huh? Because the Damir is Mustatir. Wa Iyaka, again it will come in the fourth column. And Nasta'inu will come in the third column. Huh? Very good. Wa Kada Rabbuka. And your Lord has decreed. Wa Kada Rabbuka. What is Rabbu? It's a file. Huh? Allah, which is Anla. Huh? 
Ta'abudu illa iyahu. So when will you put Ta'abudu? Where is the vow? It's visible. So it will come Al-Vaw Al-Vaw Fi Ta'abudu will come here. Can you see the vow as a file? It will come here. Huh? Sister Hafsa, Sister Abir, Sister Sumaya, see, you, can you see the vow? Yes. Is that the file? Yes. Huh? It is muttasil. It is, so it will come here. Huh? You will say, al-vaw, fi, ta'abudu will come here. Huh? And then, illa, yahu, you know, yahu will come in the fourth column. Wa bil walidaini, ihsanan. Okay. But this is such a beautiful verse. And inshallah, you will be able to understand it. Wakada eh? Rabbuka, and your Lord has decreed that you will not worship except Him. Wabiwalidaini ihsanan. What is this ihsanan? Mafulun mutlaq. Okay? That is your mafulun mutlaq. So whenever there is a mafulun mutlaq, there has to be a verb. There has to be a verb. Fail and file has to be there. So brother, this is what it is. Hassan, what did I write? Ahsinu Ihsan. What form of verb is this? Form 4. What is the verb? Ahsana Yohsinu. Ahsana Yohsinu. Okay, and from here, brothers and sisters, Yohsinu. I can see two dots, but maybe the camera may not pick it up. Yohsinu. Okay, brothers and sisters, look at it. Huh? Make Amar from Yohsin. Ahsin. 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 Do the best. Huh? Do the best. Ahsana means he did excellent, he did very well. Huh? So, Yohsinu, make Amar, Ahsin, and then Ahsina, and then Ahsinu. So, this is your Amar. Ahsinu, Felu Amarin, Mabniyun Ala, Hadfi Noon. Because actually it is Tah Sinuna, Tah Sinuna. And from there you got Ahsinu. Ahsinu. Okay, brother. Ahsana. Make the master out of it. Ihsan. Huh? So see here in the Quran, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Bil walidaini ihsanan. Huh? Maybe you will, somebody will tell you this is the translation. But understanding in Arabic, will make you understand that, of course, ihsanan is mafulun mutlaq. So then, where is the verb? Where is the verb? And then your knowledge will tell you that ihsanan is from four, master, then the verb has to come from the master. And you know, by somebody showing you a few times, will make your mind understand and it will move on its uh, so what is the the commandment of Allah? Allah Wakada Rabbuka and your Lord has decreed, brother, can Allah change his mind? Then okay, now you worship me and then tomorrow we'll say no worship somebody else. No, he cannot say that. Okay? The law is law and that Allah has decreed.
what Allah has decreed? Kada Rabbuka, Allah has decreed. Allah ta'budu illa iyahu. You do not worship anybody except Him. Wa bil walidaini. Brother? Bil walidaini. What is walidaini? Mother and father. Bil walidaini. Ahsinu. Do your best. Ihsanan. Look after them. Take care of them with the best of your ability. Are you with me? This is the command of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But if we do not read Quran and we do not understand, then that's why parents are being neglected there. People do not realize their responsibilities. If you want to please Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, two things are necessary. One is to worship Him alone. Second, to look after your parents. If you do not look after your parents, if we do not look after our parents, brother and sister, don't expect Allah to be happy with you. Uh, you want the pleasure of Allah? Then these are the two things. Worship Him alone, purely. The worship should be for Him and Him alone. And the second thing should be, if you have parents still alive, you got to look after them. Such a powerful message, brother. You got the idea, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. Well, let's finish it in the next five minutes. Yukhrijuna. What do you see in Yukhrijuna? Uh, sister Aisha, what do you see in Yukhrijuna? Wow. So where will I put Yukhrijuna? I will put it in this column. You will say, Al Wow, fi Yukhrijuna is your Damir Rafa Muttasil. Okay? Rasula wa iyakum. Where will iyakum come? Ah, why it has come? Because li buku ihi bada harfil atf. Bada harfil atf. It has come after conjunction. Are you with me? Why? Because it has come after conjunction, you see. وَإِنَّا وَإِيَّاكُمْ لَأَلَى هُدَمْ أَوْ فِي دَلَالِ الْمُبِينَ إِنَّا Truly, we or you are certainly on a guidance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala or we are totally misled or misguided. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? We have to read the verses, few verses before and after to understand the complete message of this verse. In na. So what is na? So it will come in the fifth column. Huh? And then yakum will come in the fourth column. Why yakum has come? Atf. It has come after atf. Okay, fine, brother and sister. Yusma'u raninul jarsi. The sound of the bell is heard. Okay. Haza yomu viaratil mudari sina iyana. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Haza yomu viaratil mudari sina iyana. Brother, what is iyana here? Mafulun bihi for master. Mafulun bihi for master. Are you with me? For master. Okay. Iyana. Fil mahjai. Okay. Today is the day the teachers will visit us. Huh? So you know you can change that. You can change that sentence. What will you write down? Brothers and sisters, write down, huh, please. Haza. Yawmu, see it is coming as a mudaf now. Huh? It is khabar, but it is mudaf. This is your mudaf li. Yazuru na al mudarri 
Mudarri Suna. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? So now you see, Ziyarat, Ziyaratul Mudarrisina became Yazuruna Al Mudarrisuna. So see, Adil Mudarrisuna, is it fine? No. But to the Ziyarati, it is Mudafilehi. Got the idea? This is where this sentence will apply. Huh? This sentence will apply there. Huh? Okay. But do you understand the meaning of it, brothers and sisters? Huh? This is the day, okay, the teachers will visit us in the dormitory. Nantazirul huh? Mudira, we will we will wait for the mudir wa iyaka. Why iyaka? It has come after atf. Okay. Bada salatil asri. Sanazuru kum inshallah. Mudaris is saying, we will visit you inshallah. Okay, brothers and sisters, where will this sanazuru come? Nazuru will come in third column. Huh? Because the file is mustatir. Okay, and then kum will come. Where will the kum come together? In the fifth column, huh? because it is damir muttasil huh? nasab. It's damir muttasil, uh, damiru nasbi muttasil. Huh? So it will come in the fifth column. Huh? No, there is no wow here. Wow is part of the verb. Huh? It is the file is mustatil. So where will it come? Here, Nazuru will come here. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Now, I have a request. We are taking a break now. This, to me, is an easy lesson. A very easy lesson. Why I say that? Uh, I'm not hard on you, brothers and sisters. Because we have done this so much in the past. If you sit down at home, you, you have a weekend in your hand. And if you do it properly... Uh, Brother, what will happen? You will become very strong. Huh? Because you do understand. If I say to you, Ataitu ka, what is Ataitu? What is tu? File. We have done it. Huh? If I say, Zahabtu ila suk, what is Zahabtu? What is tu? Well, you know that, brother. Huh? Where will you put here, Zahabtu? You will put it here. In this column, atau, uh, atau fi zahabtu is your mutassil. Don't you know this? And then if, if I say atai tu ka, don't you know ka? Mafulun bi, we know it. So what is so difficult about it? No, you get too confused in the class. So don't worry, brothers and sisters. I request you, if you do it religiously, you will become master. And this is an opportunity. Do it, brothers and sisters. Now, let us take a break, inshallah. Sisters, we are back eh? uh, from our break. Brother eh? Hassan, Jazakallah for your uh, treating the class with samosas. Eh? Jazakallah, may Allah bless you and your family, brothers and sisters. Eh? We pray for Brother Hassan. Okay, brothers and sisters. Now, I have to tell you something that... If we had not done this exercise the way we did it, brothers and sisters, and if I had asked you verbally, mata uh, taitani iyaha, you would have been able to tell me very fluently that ataita ta is the file, nunu vikaya, ya mutakallim, mafulun bihi, and iya ha mafulun bihi. You would have been able to tell me. But because we had to put it into proper columns, you got confused. Huh? You got confused. Okay? But if you do it the way Dr. Sam is asking us to do, you will become stronger, brother. This is not something you, you don't know. The only thing new in this uh, lesson is the mafulun bihi. Uh, for the master. That is the new thing. Otherwise, everything 
else you know it. Huh? So I request you to sit down and do it at home and write it the way Dr. Abdurrahim has asked us to do. And you can take the help from Hello Tamarin, inshallah. Okay, brothers and sisters. Now we come to uh, section four. Taddim. Kaddimil mafoola bihi alal fairly fi kulli jumlatin mim mayati. What does it mean of kaddim? Precede it. Huh? Bring it before. The verb is coming after. You bring it before. Now, quick. Here is an example. Nabuduka became Iyaka Nabudu. Are you with me, brother and sister? Okay. Sister Hafsa, Nasta, Nastainuka. Iyaka Nastainu. Nastainuka. Iyaka Nastainu. Got the idea? Sister Abir, Nastagafiruka. Iyaka Nastagfiru. But this is like samosas. Huh? This is so easy. Uh, Sumaya, sister, Raituhu. Iyahu Raitu. Mashallah, Iyahu Raitu. Sister Fatima. Huh? Okay, sister Naima. Uh, Nadaitani, ya Ustad. How will you say? There's a little difficult word here. The verb is a little difficult. Sister Aisha. Anadaitani ya ustad. Tell me where is the mafulun bihi ya mutakalam. It has to come in the front. So what will you say? Aya ya. And then nadaita. Ya ya. Nadaita ya ustad. You got the idea, Sister Naima? Aya ya. Nadaita. What is the meaning? Did you call me? Aya ya. Nadaita. Fine. You do one more. She said, Naima, you do one more. Tatlubuha al mudaritu. Tatlubuha al mudaritu. Now, what will happen now? Ha will become? Iya ha. Iya ha tatlubul mudiratu. Got the idea? Iya ha tatlubul mudiratu. Fine. She said, Nasreen. Sa'alahum al-mudiru. Sa'alahumul mudiru. Sa'alahumul mudiru. So what will you say? Masha'Allah. Excellent. Masha'Allah. Masha'Allah. May Allah increase your knowledge, sister uh, Nasreen, and all of us, inshallah. Uh, we have come a long way. Uh, see, now you are able to do it, alhamdulillah. Uh, next one, brothers and sisters. You got to use illa, huh? And you have to use ma in front of it, okay? Tamalil misal, from mahavil, chumalal atiyata ala hirariha, mustamilan, musta, mustamilan, illa. But you have to use ma also. Mustamilan, illa, using illa, huh? Raituhu ma raaitu illa iyahu. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Fine. Now, uh, sister Nusrat, na budu hu ma ma shala ma na budu illa iyahu. Is it easy? Uh, it's very easy, brother. Uh, okay. Yuhibbuni al mudarrisu. Ma yuhibbuni Ma yuhibbul mudarrisu illa iyaya. The mudarris does not love anyone except me. Very good. Sister Arifa. Da'ana al mudiru. Mashallah, ma da'a al mudiru illa iya na. Ma da'a al mudiru illa iya na. Very good. Huh? Now, Brother Muhammad, would you like to try it? Akabakahum. Akabakahum. 
ul mudarrisu padasan ha correct mudar illa iyahum ha but all you have to do is ma akabal mudarrisu illa iyahum that's all you did it well mashallah very good ha huh? now we have here between the brackets instructions dhamirul mutaqallim dhamirul mukhatab are you with me dhamirul mukhatabina this is jama okay now what you have to do brothers and sisters da fil faragh fi ma yati dhamira nasbin munfasilan istamil al naw al maskura Bainal Kausaini means use the kind mentioned between the two brackets. Are you with me? You have to put in the empty space uh, a proper Damir Nasb Munfasil. Uh, you'll have to put a proper detached mansub pronoun huh? and use the kind mention between the two brackets did you understand me brothers and sisters inshallah talabal mudiru ahmada and then damir mutakallim wa iyaya see see ana brother ana is marfu we got to have mansub and wow has come the exercise is for damir nasab damiru nasbi munfasil ha huh? the exercise is for damiru nasbi al munfasil okay so talab al mudiru ahmada wa iya ya no brothers and sisters we are bound to make mistakes there is no problem there if you make a mistake we learn from our mistakes so do not worry okay so sir hafsa sala al mudarrisu ibrahima wa wa iya ka ha wa iya ka as'ilatan sabatan translation the teacher asked ibrahim and and you and you lot of difficult question as'ilatan Sabatan. Sala al mudarrisu Ibrahima wa iyaka as'ilatan sabatan. Difficult questions. Huh? Got the idea? Abir, Damir mutakallim. Okay. Inna hamidan wa iyaya. Huh? Because it is najihani, only two people are successful. If it was Najihuna, then you would have said Iyana. But it is Najihani means two. Are you with me, Sister Abi? So, in Hamidan wa wa Iyaya Najihani bi takdiri mamtazin. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? So, you got to write it. Huh? These are very beautiful exercises. Will make you very strong. You got to write it. You have. Three days in your hand, inshallah. You'll find time to write it, inshallah. So, Sister Sumaya, Saadul Mudarisina. Now it is Damir Mukhatta Bina. This is Jama. Huh? Okay. Saadul Mudarisina. I will invite the teachers. Wa Iya Kum. Wa Iya Kum Mukhatta. Okay, iyakum ila maadabatin. What is maadabatin? Walima. What is the meaning of maadabatin? Walima, inshallah. Translation, I will invite the teachers and you all uh, to walima. Okay, inshallah. Now, sister Naima, there is a very nice example. Simple. Damirul Ghaib. Are you with me? Damirul Ghaib. Huh? Okay, fine. 
اعرف ان کا و ماشاء اللہ ماشاء اللہ may Allah bless you with more knowledge uh, sister Naima and all of us see it's, it's not difficult and you got to do it inshallah arifu annaka wa yahu mujtahidani I know you I know that you and uh, him are hard working fine brothers and sisters now comes again little bit of tough check piece brothers and sisters حول الجملة الآتية حول الجملة الآتية على غرار المثال مستعملا المستر Are you with me brothers and sisters? Now we got to use the master, change it and make a master out of it Okay, watch this carefully ننتظر أن يزورنا المدير Okay, what is the sentence given here? Okay, one more time. Nantaziru, nantaziru an yazurana al mudiru. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? What is yazura? Nantaziru an yazurana al mudiru. What is yazura? Felul mudarion mansub. Are you with me? What is now? Mafulun bi. You know that. And what is al-mudiru? Fahil. Now how is the sentence changed? Nantaziru ziyarat al-mudiri iyana. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Nantaziru ziyarat al-mudiri iyana. Now you got to do it, the other sentences, but I'll help you. Okay, brothers and sisters? Nuridu an- يُخْرِجَهُ الْمُدَرِّسُ مِنَ الْفَصْلِ Are you with me, brothers and sisters? نُرِيدُ أَن يُخْرِجَهُ الْمُدَرِّسُ مِنَ الْفَصْلِ Translation, brother. We want that the teacher should take him out of the... Are you with me? Now, we got to change it into master. Huh? Okay. So, يُخْرِ Jahu, what is the verb? Akhraja, form four. Form four. So, what is the master? Ifalun, ikhrajun. What is the master? Ikhrajun. I will write down, please. You you check it, huh? Ikhrajun, brother. Now, let us do, brother. Nu Nuridu Did you see, brothers and sisters, huh? how we change it? Nuridu, yukhri jahu became ikhraja, and the mudarisu was file. It became now mudafilehi. Huh? It became mudafilehi. See, the same jumla will apply, apply here. Huh? This yahu huh, is livukui maf'ulan. Li masterin mudafin ila fa'ilihi. So where is the uh, master? Ikhraj. And this is your mudafilihi. And now it is actually a file. How is it file? When you change it to nuridu an yukhrijahu al mudarisu. So write down this sentence uh, in front of the one which is mentioned in the book. This is number two. Can you see the number two? Can you read the number two, brothers and sisters? Nuridu an yukhrijahu al mudarisu min al fasli. Now change it and it can come like this. Nuridu ikhraj al mudarisi 
Yahu min al fasli. We want the taking of Mudarisu, taking of Mudarisu him. We want the taking of Mudarisu him from the fasl. Now, brothers and sisters, you will not literally translate, but you will translate that we want that the teacher should take him out of the class. That's the normal translation. We'll do it in English. Okay. If you try to do literal translation, it may not make sense in English. Fine, brother and sister. This is another tough chickpea, but interesting chickpea, brother and sisters. Ohibuka aksara mimma tohibuni. What is the translation? I love you more than you love me. Okay, brother and sister, how will you write it now? Hubbi iyaka. What will you say? Hubbi. Hubbi iyaka aksara aksara min Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Hobbi Iaka, my love for you is more than your love for me. Are you with me? So you have a two ways of writing the same sentence. Okay? Please write it and ponder over it. And if you don't get it in one day or two days or three days, what shall I tell you? Don't worry. Huh? Over a period of a week or two weeks, when you will revise, inshallah, you will get it. Or when we, when we will give you the DVDs and you will watch it, inshallah, you will get it, inshallah. Huh? Next one, brothers and sisters. Ajib an al asilat al atiati ala ghirar al misal. Answer the following questions on the pattern of the example. Aina kitabul mudiri. What is your answer? Ataitu hu iahu. Got the idea? Now you got to do the same thing. We'll start from Sister Afsa again. Aina Majalatul Mudarrisi. Mashallah. Ataituhu Iyaha. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? That was excellent, Sister Afsa. May Allah bless you with more knowledge and all of us. Sister Abir. Aina Kalamu Okhti. Ha. Iyaha subhanallah. See, it just requires thinking. Ataitu ha. Because ukhti, you know, so ataitu ha. And kalam is iyahu. That was excellent, Sister Rabi. May Allah bless you with more knowledge. And all of us, inshallah. Sister Sumaya. Aina dafati rutu labi. Ataitu hum. And then iyaha. Kulu jama monas. Are you with me? The fatiru? Kulu jama monas. So it will become yaha. Huh? Okay. Sister Naima, inshallah you will make an effort. Don't worry about mistakes. I will guide you. Aina the fatiru akhwati. See, here is the fatiru, which is kulu jama monas. And akhwati. Okay. So ataitu. Masha'Allah, ataitu hunna, and then iyaha. 100% correct. Masha'Allah, that was excellent. Huh? May Allah bless you with more knowledge. Huh? I'm so pleased with your answers. Alhamdulillah. And inshallah, Allah will bless all of us with more knowledge. Sister Aisha, aina hakibatu ummi. 
No, we got to use two kinds of damir. One is mutasil and other is munfasil. If you don't do that, what will happen? What will happen? No, no, no. That is not Arabic. Excellent. Sister Nasreen, inshallah, we do not have telegrams these days. Aina Barkiyata Hamidin. So it is Barkiyatani. Remember? Two, huh? Aina Barkiyata Hamidin. So what will you say? Ataitu Hu Jewel. Iyahuma. What will you say? Ataitu Hu Iyahuma. Because there are two telegrams. Huh? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Alhamdulillah. Now, Sister Nusrat. Would you like to try it? Aina Rasailul Mudarisina. See, Rasailu is also Jama, Kulu Jama Monas. So what will you say? Ataitu hum mashaallah. Ataitu hum iyaha. Alhamdulillah. You got to write it. Huh? Write it at home and you will enjoy it. Reading the sentence, writing the sentence and you will become strong inshallah. Okay. Now here we have sentences in which, okay, the, the pronouns are from different category. Okay. Watch it carefully, brother. First example is solved for us. Man allamaka kiyadata sayarati. Translation. <coughs> Who taught you the driving of the car? Mashallah. Huh? Who taught you the driving of the car? Driving out the car. What is the answer? Allamani ha. Ha is your kiada. Huh? Driving. Allamani ha ahi. Okay. So allamani and then ha. They are there. And we can use it this way because those uh, uh, damair are from different category. Huh? One is ghaib. And one is Mutakallim. Are you with me? How will you do and change it? One you will make it Mutasil and other you will make it Munfasil. How will you do it brothers and sisters? Allamani Iyaha Akhi. Got the idea? Fine. Now Sister Mahanas, you have a question. Man Ataka Hadal Khatama. Khatama is your Ring. Huh? Ring. Okay. Translation. Who gave you this ring? Huh? Atani. You will say Atani. Huh? Atani. But then Khatam. Atani he. Atani he. Because you got to have two maful and three. Remember these. Ata yuti needs two mafulun bihi. So, ata nihi, abhi you can say, anything you want to say. Change it now, brother, uh, Sister Mayanas. Sister Mayanas, change it to the different. Ata ni iyahu abhi. MashaAllah. Excellent, excellent. Brother Hassan, you'll take a challenge? Ah, what is the translation? Mata Tautini Hazal Kitab. The translation is, when will you give me this book? Now you will say, I will give you. So it will be, Oti Ka Hu. Gadan. Got the idea? Oti Ka Hu Gadan. I will give it to you tomorrow. Now change it. Oti Ka Yahu Gadan. Kalas. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? You understood? Sister Abhi? Sister Aisha? Sister Sumaya, inshallah? You understood? Alhamdulillah. Now, Sister Abza, here's the sentence for you. Mata Turini Baitaka. Translation. When will you show me your house? Mashallah. Mata. Turini Baitaka. When will you show me your house? 
What is the answer? Uri ka Uri ka who? Hazal Masa. Or you can say Bada Gadin. Uh, day after tomorrow or whatever you want to say. Are you with me? Badal's boy. Uh, I will show you after a week. Uh, so now you will say Uri Kahu uh, Bada Gadan you can say or you can say Uri Kahu Masan mean evening or what will you say? Uri Ka Yahu Uri Ka Yahu Got the idea? This is a very easy exercise, brother. You've got to write it now. Inshallah, you'll write it. Huh? If you want to become proficient and fluent, you've got to work hard, brother and sisters. Nothing comes from nothing. Huh? Nothing comes from nothing. No pain, no gain. Man jadda vajada. Man zara'a hasada. Only those who will work hard will succeed. Jo soya, wo khoya. Jo jaga, wo paya. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Now, you have something more to say? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Maybe you have another proverb. <laughs> Number 10. Tamarinun shafviyun. This is a verbal exercise. I want you to do it at home, brothers and sisters. Among your friends. Or you can do among yourselves, sisters, brothers, inshallah. Yakulu talibun li akhara. A student tells to the other person, Yuridu fulanun. See, watch carefully. Yuridu fulanun. Kitabaka. Someone wants your book. Or daftaraka. Or kalamaka. So then you are asking him, Afa utihi iyahu? How are you answering, brothers and sisters? Afa utihi iyahu? Translation? Shall I give it to him? Fine. Wa yujibu talibul mas'ulu. And the students who has been asked uh, answers. How he answers, brothers and sisters? Naam. Atihi iyahu. What is Ati here? Fialu Ammarhen. Mabniyun ala hazafi harfi ila. So, what is the translation? Give it to him. Give it to him. Atihi iyahu. Au, if you don't want to give, then what will you say? La. La totihi iyahu. What is the meaning of this? Don't give. So what is la toti? Can sister uh, Abir tell me? This is la and nahiya. Uh, not nafiya, but then she says nahiya. So toti is machisun. La means no. Don't give him. It's a command. Uh, so la nahiya to fidu amar. La toti hi iya. Who? Huh? Don't give it to him. So what is toti? Fehlun, mudariun, majizumun, bi, hazafi, harfi, illa. Where is the file? Mustatir. Takdiruhu anta. So inshallah if you can practice it, it will be very useful to you. Huh? You can try it among yourself. And if you cannot find anybody, then you play the dual role. You ask the question yourself. And then you answer the question yourself. Okay? Practice. The whole idea is to practice. Okay, brother and sister. Yusmau raninul jarsi. Ranin is the sounding of the bell. It is the master from Ranna yarinu. Wahuwa la vazni fa'ilun. Okay? Hati masadar al afwal al atiyati ala vazan fa'il. Safara yasfiru. What is safara? To whistle. Huh? To whistle. Huh? Siti bajana. Safara yasfiru. To whistle. So what will be whistling? Safirun. 
Shahara Yashkiru, to snort, huh? force the air from the nose with a sound, you know, it makes a noise, you know. So what will be? Shahirun. What is the meaning of Shahirun? Snorting. Sahala Yashilu. What is the meaning of Sahala Yashilu? Neighing. Neighing. Neighing of the house. Huh? Sahilun. Fine, brothers and sisters. Hati Chama. Durju, the drawer. The Jama is Adarajun. What is the Jama? Adarajun, brother. Adarajun. Huh? Adarajun. And then the next one is Khawa Timu. What is the Jama of Khatamun, brothers and sisters? What is the Jama of Khatamun? Khawatimu. Huh? Khatamun means ring and then rings. Okay, fine, brother. The last exercise is very easy and very interesting. Hati al Mudariya wal Amar min afwal al Atiyati. Okay, brothers and sisters? I asked Sister Nasreen. <coughs> okay, inshallah. Tazakkara. What form is this, Sister Nasreen? Tazakkara. Form 5, mashallah. What will be the mudariya? Tazakkaru. Mashallah. And what will be the amar? Tazakkar. No kasra. Tazakkar. Beautiful. See, you did it. Alhamdulillah. May Allah bless you with more knowledge and all of us. Sister Aisha, Kada. Yakdi make amar ikdi. What will you say? Ikdi. Huh? Kada. I have, I'm running out of space. Kada. Yakdi. And then how will you make amar? Brother Hassan, chop. Chop here. Huh? And bring Hamza, huh? Ikti. Huh? Now, Kada has many meaning, many, many meanings. So, you have to see the dictionary and, and find out the meaning. Brother Inshallah. If the Kada has come here, the blue dictionary that Dr. Abdurrahim has written will help you. Uh, we have given you. Huh? All of you have it, Inshallah. Make use of it. It saves a lot of time. Okay. Okay. Uh, Sumaya, huh? Basmala, Basmala. What will be the mudariya? No, Nusrat, Basmala. You Basmilu, <coughs> sister Sumaya. Four-letter verb. Are you with me? Basmala, you Bas. Milu, huh? you bas milu. Got the idea? Zalzala, you zalzilu. Are you with me? Tarjama, you tarjimu. Okay, Amar. Hmm? What will be the Amar? Very easy. Sister Sumaya, Basmil. Don't say Bismil. <laughs> we are used to saying Bismil. Basmil. Huh? Huh? What is the meaning of Basmil? Say Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Huh? Basmil means say Bismillahir Rahman. Alhamdulillah, brothers and sisters, we finished two minutes to go. <laughs> Alhamdulillah, from our uh, specified timings. I have a request. You have a weekend in front of you. You will revise this lesson, inshallah. And you will read the key of the next lesson. The Mafulun Mutlaq has finally arrived. Huh? We got to receive it on Monday. Huh? Now remember, brothers and sisters, if you read the key, if you don't understand, what will you do? Read it again. Read it slowly. Read it two times, three times. And try to understand as much as you can. And we will go very slowly so that you have a good understanding of 
مفعول المطلق ان شاء الله اوكي وربنا اعطينا في الدنيا حسنه وفي الاخره حسنه وقنا عذاب النار ربنا هب لنا من ازواجنا وذرياتنا قرة اعين واجعلنا للمتقين اماما اللهم عين على ذكرك وشكرك وحسن عبادتك ربنا تقبل منا انك انت السميع العليم وتب علينا انك انت التواب الرحيم سبحان ربك رب العزه عما يصفون وسلامون على المرسلين والحمد لله رب العالمين جزاكم الله